elementary school here in Green Bay. Please give them a warm labor welcome. Thank you. Ever since Scott Walker took office, I've been disappointed in our state. Wisconsin has always been a state that people across the United States have looked up to. Wisconsin's education system has always been top notch, and Wisconsin has always understood the importance of a strong middle class. My name is Jason Elberts. I am a paraprofessional educator at Webster Elementary. My wife is a special education teacher at Foxview Intermediate. Scott Walker's anti-worker budget and legislation have affected us tremendously. Besides the obvious financial strain to our family, Scott Walker and his cronies are attempting to silence us and take away our ability to do our jobs and to serve our students. He is taking away the resources our children need in order to succeed. First of all, Scott Walker and his cronies are robbing our unborn child of the opportunity to have a good public education, to enjoy our state parks and our public libraries, and so much more. Walker's anti-worker legislation doesn't hurt only my family. It hurts all Wisconsin families. By destroying core resources like public education, health care, and other community services that all people rely on every day. <coughs> Scott Walker and his cronies are attempting to destroy our state. Ever since they have been in power, Wisconsin doesn't seem to be Wisconsin at all, but a place known as Fitzwalker Stand. They have divided our state, and they have pitted neighbor against neighbor. Same family, too. Family against family. They have tried to silence us by passing laws in the middle of the night that take away our voice at the table. They have passed a budget that hurts Wisconsin families, but helps wealthy special interest groups. Scott Walker and his cronies think that we are going to go away. They think that they have silenced us, but we are still here. Scott Walker and his cronies have underestimated us. They think they have divided us, but we are now more united than ever. We have shown Scott Walker and his cronies that we will not be silenced by defeating all six of the spoiler candidates. We have marched in the rain. We have marched in the snow. It is time to take our state back. We will now march in the hot sun and knock on doors. We will make phone calls. We will talk to our neighbors. We will talk to our friends. We will replace legislators that are Walker's puppets and replace them with legislators that will work for the people of Wisconsin, like Dave Hansen and Nancy Nussbaum. We will not stop until we take our state back. Woo -hoo!